and oh my god, crap, been naked three times in this video. When I met you in the summer. Hey guys, it's Summer. Welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm showing you how to glow up from a zero to like a thousand. So from this to this and pretty self-explanatory. So without further ado, let's get into today's video. Here I am at a solid zero. Messy hair and I'm all sweaty from working out. I need to shower so bad. Bags under my eyes. My nails are a wreck. So let's start this glow up. Step one is get Dunkin'. And you might be like summer that is completely unnecessary, but it's just not, and here's why. So like Duncan takes my personality from like a one to like a seven million because like normally I'm like calm and collected and like bleh. But like caffeine, just like I'm on caffeine right now, and so like I'm trying to slow down my talking, but like it just like makes me more hyper and like more comfortable and like in scary social situations, I'm more likely to like put myself out there and like be talkative and like not scared. Personality is very important, like looks are not everything. This glow up is like personality wise and looks wise. So first you gotta fix the personality. Okay, with that out of the way, step two is definitely shower. I think that's pretty important because you don't wanna go anywhere with greasy hair. Oh my god, <laughs> I can't. And you don't wanna go anywhere smelling bad. So like showering is pretty important. In your shower, step three would be shave. You don't want whoever's filling up your legs to get a gross touch. So <laughs> let's hop right in. Shower time. So I'm fresh out of the shower and my new Victoria's Secret towel wrap and my hair up in a towel to dry a little bit. Next step I'm gonna do is put on a pore strip. I'm gonna snap and I'm gonna have it on, ready? Okay, as you know, that needs to dry for a while. So while it dries, we're gonna be productive and do my nails and toes because everything has to be perfect. Let's get into it. And I'm starting to do my nails. Yes, I'm staying in my towel wrap and towel. Here's my nail polish remover and we're gonna take this white off my nails. Okay, I removed all my nail polish and now I'm gonna paint them white because it makes me look tanner. Nails are painted. As my hair finishes towel drying, I'll let my nails dry and then I'll take off my pore strip and start to fix my hair. Let's take off my pore strip. Ow. Okay, I need to wash this off. That actually worked pretty good. Normally I would not do a pore strip before I go out, but like it's fine because like while the redness has time to fade, I'll be drying my hair. It's not like my nose is gonna be like red when I go out because I'm giving it like time to calm down. Okay, my nose actually isn't even that red, but next step is hair. Oh God, we need some work. So I have a few necessity products. First is Kirstas Nourishing Milk. Then, pure stuff, like leave in. And lastly, this Moroccan oil. So I'm gonna like work all of those into my hair and brush it with my wet brush as I go. little close to a middle part but I need to blow dry it and my mom blow dries my hair don't judge I'm not that good at it but I'm gonna go have her blow dry it that's our next step in the glow up I've seriously got down how to work with my lighting like this is so good okay sorry that sounded so conceited so my hair is now dry and I just change into a little tank top to do my makeup important step not to forget is put on deodorant it's crucial and then definitely I have to brush my teeth because I drank a coffee, oh. but I'm not going to show that because I brush my teeth kind of gross, not even going to lie. So I'm going to brush them and be right back. Okay, teeth are brushed and now it's time for the best part, makeup. I cannot find my really good, oh my god, it's sitting right here. I couldn't find my good Bobbi Brown. So let's get started. In the summer, I tend to not wear as much makeup as I would otherwise because like I already have a tan and stuff. But I'm just gonna do a little bit of concealer under my eyes and above my lip just to like make my skin look more even. So we're gonna go under the eyes and above them to even out my skin. And I'm doing on my lip and of course on my little blemish right there and on my chin. And then let's blend that. <laughs> I really hope this color isn't too light for my skin tone. Okay, 
Okay, that looks pretty blended. Oh, maybe. That looks pretty blended to me. I can't tell if that's completely not matching my skin or not. Next, I don't even wear makeup anymore. What do I even do next? Um, oh, next I'm gonna add just a tiny bit of bronzer just to like even out my color of the concealer and my like actual tanner skin. I just never wear bronzer in the summer because like I don't want to look fake or anything and I don't need it. But since I'm glowing up from a zero to a hundred, I need a little bit. So I'm using the Hoola bronzer and just a tiny little bit. Making sure to tap it off so it's just like minimal amount. probably evened out my color the Sun has made my hair so much lighter I really like it underneath my eyes I'm just gonna use a little bit of this powder foundation to keep it from creasing and then a tiny bit of glittery eyeshadow because I'm like going to like a hundred and we're just being extra using the Tarte Rainforest of the Sea palette let's get started so let's talk well freshman year just ended and let me share my opinions so for me freshman year was not great in fact it was kind of bad well actually grade wise I did really good not gonna lie between juggling being a YouTube star and school I think I did a good job but like I really need to like pick up my social antics because I don't have like friends you know what I mean so like vlogging at school those are like really popular like school vlogs and stuff and I would love to but like I don't have anyone in my school to like vlog with you know so obviously my freshman year was not stellar but I'm actually looking at like switching schools so you never really know how next year's gonna be or what's gonna happen we'll see so um here's my eyeshadow though just a little bit of glitter my lips are so chapped but it's the summertime and my life has been improving. Next, I'm going in with the Bobbi Brown Gel Eyeliner. Oh, that was the best I've done in a while. Uh-oh. Next, I have mascara. So first, curl your eyelashes, that's crucial. But like last night, I was just sitting at home and I literally had like nothing to do. I was just like laying on the couch and it was like so refreshing to be like, I literally can just sit here and do nothing. I don't have to like study, I don't have any homework. And that's why I've been like filming a lot of YouTube. Like when I'm bored, I'll just be like, oh, I can just like film a new video. But like in a week, I'm starting up summer classes. So I'm taking honor summer chemistry. At my school, you can take summer sciences. That voice crack was so unattractive. But um, I'll be at the beach every weekend, which like isn't great. I'd rather be there every week. But just to get that class out of the way is definitely important for me okay mascara wise I'm using this L'Oreal voluminous and it's like not a great brand but it's actually really good mascara so I use this to like lengthen my lashes and then I go in quickly while it's wet with my better than sex just like mainstream you know oh I keep getting my hair in it and the better than sex like makes your lashes thicker while the L'Oreal like makes them longer so the combination of the two is really good why did I say it like that I was like really good so the combination of the two is really good <laughs> then I'm using this NYX lip liner in the shade 810 <laughs> little too matte for my liking but I can like put stuff on top then I'm gonna use this other NYX random butter stick it's a little too pink and then this chapstick total hydration and has like a little more color oh ew it was like melty and then just a little bit of random sparkly lip gloss on top I love my lips to be sparkly Okay, so that's that and then to finish my lip I just take a little bit of my lightest shade in the rainforest of the sea palette and put it on my like cupid's bow on my lips and it just enhances your lip look so here's my final makeup and I know it's not like a lot but it's just because it's the summertime and I don't like to wear a ton of makeup in the summer less is more especially like when I have a little bit of a tan so next I need to change out of my casual little tank top and into a cute outfit with like new jewelry especially not this like casual beachy look but before i change i need to flat iron my hair a little bit as you can see my baby hairs are a little stubborn and it could just be a little bit straighter i have seriously mastered my lighting like look at this it's like prime i just can't it looks so good okay so i definitely want to flat iron the baby hairs and just kind of all over and flat ironing it like like not only gets it straight but like keeps it straight and if like you do a really good job blow drying obviously your hair is going to look pretty straight but the flat iron just like keeps it from frizzing up especially in the summer humidity um what else can we chat about i just wish that i could like get my youtube to go viral because especially at school 
I got so much hate. Honestly, I just think it's fun. And, like, I'm learning so much about, like, editing. I just know if I went viral or something, people, like, wouldn't think that it was as weird. Or, like, judge me as much. And, obviously, I don't really care because, like, I'm still doing it. I'm not, like, complaining. It's just, like, kind of frustrating, you know? But, I mean, people still watch it. So, obviously, they don't hate it that much. But I find it pretty enjoyable. So, my hair is, like, about as flat ironed. I was like, actually, I'm just going to go into the mirror and finish flat ironing, and then we're going to pick on my outfit and jewelry. So here's my hair I just finished, and now I'm going to show you the outfit I picked out. It's so cute. So I changed into this cute top from a little boutique called Raina Dawn. Oh my god, I'm flashing. So I changed into this cute top from this boutique called Raina Dawn, and I'm going to change my jewelry, and then you can see the final product. So for jewelry, I went pretty simple because the top's like busy with all the colors and stripes. So I'm just wearing this hanging dick neck. Dick neck, hanging disc necklace and these gold hoops simple but cute and oh my god crap been naked three times in this video <laughs> and my Cartier love ring with my freshly painted nails I'm wearing this top with white American Eagle jeans and these cute summer wedges by Lucky Brand with my freshly painted white toenails <laughs> So that's it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. If you're new, be sure to like and subscribe for more great content and quality videos. Yeah. And I hope you enjoyed today's video and learned how to glow up because I think it was a pretty good tutorial. And that's about it. So thanks again for watching and I'll see you next time.